got to do. Mwah. No? No pressure. Right. Um, Reagan is technically feeling better because the doctors say that she's feeling better. But she still has like a very, very like chronic cough and it's really bothering me. It disrupts her sleep and apparently because she doesn't have any family history of like asthma or anything, then that means that her experience you know, the doctor has no sympathy, you know, maybe. Basically, Reagan is feeling better, but she still has like diarrhea and she has um, this coughing issue. There's a lot of congestion, a lot of stuff. I went to the doctor and the doctor was pretty much like, well, her dad doesn't have a history of this. You don't have a history of this. So she's okay. Give her honey and give her probiotics. But it's just the fact that a one-year-old has been coughing for almost a month or yeah a month going on a month and some change and the doctors say that it's normal because of her family history i have a lot of shit that happened to me that didn't run in my family just because things don't run in your family doesn't mean that you couldn't be like the rare case or the first one you know so it kind of pissed me off that the doctor was more like you know, I'm not really concerned about it. I mean, my baby's vitals are good. Everything is fine. And it does give um, stomach bug symptoms. But what stomach bug makes you cough and be congested? And the stomach bug stuff didn't start happening um, until three weeks after she was coughing and congested. And to me, it highlighted because with her throwing up from the stomach bug, everything she was throwing up was mucus. So I was like, okay, maybe, you know, I talked about this in, in the beginning, but because I'm like, she's coughing. She can't speak for herself. I'm her voice. And you're discounting what I'm saying because you think that this is normal and I'm just panicking as a mom. But for a one year old, a cough is waking her up out of her sleep and you know she's never had a cough before it just it's you know it's not giving uh take honey and what was the other suggestion probiotics you know but anyways that's what it is so i'm about to go get granny and the girls and we're gonna go get rain's ears pierced and i will be back okay but right now it's very hot i need to turn on the ac um and drive home safely i'll be back Price is the same. <laughs> if you want to take a look and turn around, look at okay. the markings, any questions, let me know. Okay. That one is the second one to the back. Okay, no, that's perfect. I think mine were way too close to this. Those are perfect. No, this arm is holding both of her arms. Oh, okay, this one's okay. holding her forehead, looking that way. Okay. Yeah, and one, yeah, she needs to this look way. a little bit okay. like that. Once right. I'm done with this side, switch arms and face her that way. Okay. Okay? Right, you have to listen. Which arms? So, like so? Like that, yeah. Okay. Rainy. Okay. Tight, tight, tight. Hey, mommy. Okay. Ooh, you so good. She's so mean to it, yeah. She's so mean, yeah. Oh, okay. Thank oh. you. It's so pretty. It's so pretty. Reagan got some, and she's so excited to put them on. Let's do it. Reagan, let's put yours in, okay? Reagan is a big girl. Reagan is a big girl. Reagan is a big girl all day long. Sit there, Reagan. Be a big girl. See how look her big sister did it. Reagan. Reagan, be a big girl, big girl, big Reagan. Reagan. <laughs> Reagan, hold this for me, Reagan. Hold this. Reagan, hold this. Hold this, Reagan. Reagan. 
She's a bigger baby than the real baby. She wouldn't even let me put him in. We lost two of the bags. So now we have to go buy another bag because Reagan is a crybaby. And it's like, you see the smirk on her face? She gets a subtle delight of being the problem child. Two hours later. Play like they for girls. I the door when I was a young and I ain't had no money. By the time the fan came, none of these things mean nothing. Take a nap because of me. Sing 
songs, but if I go strong, she gonna hit this high. Hey, y'all. Of course, I forgot to do an outro. So this is the outro. Thank you for tuning into this video. It was just a, like, getting back to... <laughs> the basics type of vlog because when my mom and my granny leave i totally have to like reprogram them and not only them like myself like i almost this time i really fell back and i let them take over with all of their unsolicited advice and so <laughs> um not only did i show them that it's not easy having two under two without having somebody to come bring you the pampers and the diapers and the pull-ups i let them really experience life like i experienced experience like oh why are your mouth so wet but um so yeah i forgot what it was to change a diaper um <laughs> i forgot what it was to make a bottle and i was in for a rude awakening but it's been fun it's been fun <laughs> yeah i hope y'all enjoyed this content um i'm gonna be a little bit more raw on the channel as far as like home life because the way that reagan used to cooperate she's no longer cooperating it i mean look she's no longer cooperating um you see during hair time and bath time and sitting on the pot time she's not as patient hey as she used to be and rain we've always known that she was a crybaby but she's officially like actually a crybaby now so um <laughs> i'm gonna be sharing more of our chaotic like in-home stuff how i cope with um not flashing out and more like you know i'm working on my patients and learning that they're kids and this is what they do and uh <laughs> Yeah, it's been fun, but yeah. We're about to go. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And we will be back with more content sooner. It will not take us two weeks to come back this time. I promise. I was just take a little breaky break. <laughs>